What is up guys, here with a video. It's gonna be a crate opening video with the new beret sets. You see that graphic there in the top right? Pretty cool looking graphic, pretty cool looking crates. Um, we got 2,065 gold, so that will be enough for 24 crates. And you see my inventory, looks like I got enough space. Just had to do some training matches just recently to unlock more space to be able to hold more weapons. But without further ado, let's just jump into the shop and I'll talk along the way here. We'll just get right into it, man. 100% chance of assault and LMG from 4 to 6 stars. Get one LMG or handgun class weapon. It could be from a special series, except Chrome and Veteran. Let's go ahead and do our first one here. Pretty nervous. Pretty nervous. We'll watch the animation, at least for the first couple. That's a 4 star A500. That'll go in the burner pile. Crate number two. We'll open the animation. I'll go over the list here in a second. It's a four star far N. Let me take it a look. Take a look at the list here while this opens. We got AG10 Patriot, M349 Patriot. That's a four star AGK37. Pretty boring so far. Um, the CQR2000 Atom, the HMG24 Atom, the KPK LMG Shamrock, the AC30 Shamrock, the A500 Shamrock, the AC30 Dragon, the Far End Dragon, the A500 Autumn, the M349 Nightcrawler, and the AC30 Nightcrawler. That's an insane weapons list. I'll tell you that if there's a, an event to spend some gold on, it's this one, guys. I'll just go ahead and say that, you know, I, I think you should spend all your gold on this event. Um, let's see, opening another one here, another 4 star far end. Very, very disappointed so far. Let's see what else we got here. 4 star far end, are you kidding me? I don't want to spend the rest of my gold. I'm getting really scared. But out of that list, um, I currently have a 5 star CQR2000 Atom, so I'd like to upgrade that. That's a 5 star Fire N, at least it's a 5 star. Um, let's see, HMG24 Atom, I have enough for the 7 star. M349 Patriot, enough for the 7 star. AG10 Patriot, enough for the 7 star. KPK LMG Shamrock, I have none of those. Um, I do have enough for the 7 star regular KPK. I wouldn't mind making the Shamrock wouldn't be a priority but I wouldn't mind it and the AC 30s we got shamrock dragon and nightcrawler holy crap this is insane guys all these far ends I'm getting really disappointed right now let's go for another one um, AC 30s it'd be cool to have just to complete the collection but I'm not worried about them at all a 500 shamrock I need one five star to four star tab XI this is crazy disappointing man uh, I need one 5 star A500 Shamrock to be able to make the 7 star of that guy. In my opinion, the best weapon in the game. So that would be really nice to get. Um, let's see, Far End Dragon, I have a 5 star. Um, I would really enjoy making that to a 7 star someday, but... Um, I don't know. We'll see if any of, the, any of those pop up. I mean, I'm really kind of frustrated that all of these are 4 star regular Far Ends. Like, it's... You know, the dragon isn't even that good. Like, I mean, it's the best Fire End probably, but... Like, why is it being rare right now? I don't know. Just getting really anxious spending all this gold. 4 star AC 30. Let's see what else we got. We're about halfway through, guys. I'm really disappointed so far. Oh, there's a 4 star AC 30 dragon. You know, it looks fresh, but not gonna be anything special especially at four stars but you know I'll add it to the collection I'm I'm not disappointed by that but I wouldn't mind it being like a four star far end dragon so I'm actually trying to build that weapon but we can add this to the collection that's cool the updated graphics look pretty cool so whatever whatever <laughs> that sums it up whatever let's see Ah, regular 4 star AC 30. Let's get something here. Something. A500 Autumn, that'd be pretty cool to have. 
it wouldn't be a pro priority building it. I'd just take my six star Shamrock A500, but I wasn't in the game for the autumn, so. Like I've said in other videos, my long term goal would be to make a seven star of every weapon. Obviously, it's probably not possible. <laughs> I mean, it's very possible, but it's it would be a really long journey, especially without spending money. So we'll see, but there's another four star A500. This is a great event for any new players out there. Maybe I should throw that in there. Um, if you're just joining the game, I mean, now is the time. I mean, get in on this stuff. Like, these are, this is what you want, some really good assault rifles. Obviously, lots of far ends coming up, so be aware of that. But I, I did start off playing this game pretty much with a far end, so I think it makes you a better player. Learning how to play with a far end will really make you a, a tactical player, make you shoot accurately, um, you know, all that good stuff. Uh, I think it really does help. Let's see. Come on, just give us a skinned edition here. This is crazy. Four star tab XI. So disappointed. So, so, so disappointed. I really think that they lowered the drop rates in these 85 crates. And I think they also dropper. Droppered. I, I can't even talk. It's too late, guys. <laughs> um, I think they also lowered the drop rate in this event gear crate. Um, it's been a lot harder getting the recent event gear from those uh let's see still got a couple more to go Just give me something good man i remember the during the shamrock sale i opened one of these crates man and the six star shamrock a500 popped open that changed the course of my entire after pulse whatever career <laughs> i honestly probably would have quit the game if, if i didn't get that weapon it really changed everything for me Come on, what do we got? One, two, three crates left, I think. If my math estimates, estimations are close. It's way too late, I can't talk. Holy crap. I don't know. <laughs> Should I even open two more crates? Like, I have a seven star far end, come on. I'm really getting frustrated. Very frustrated. Let's see what we got, two more. There's always that hope, man. They know what they're doing with their monetization system, man. There's, all, there's just that. You just live on this hope. Like, the next crate could be something. The next crate is it. The next crate is going to be that, that six-star, you know, six-star CQR 2000 Atom. Whatever. Last one. This is it, guys. This is it. And a four-star A500. Well, that's the reality of the 85 gold crate sitting in the shop wasted so much gold on that at least we got our seasonal challenges at least i can pick up one or two more crates depending on how many challenges there are and i also noticed they stopped announcing the seasonal challenges um whatever reason that is but the last two haven't been on the forums now um if you see my setup you might be wondering about that <laughs> currently my favorite setup is to go out and have some fun with Got this uh, six star Mar 12 Atom. It's absolutely terrible, even with the gear boost. It's at least playable with the Cinco de Mayo gear set boosts, but it's just fun to troll with. Um, let's see what we got. 100% LMG and Assault, so they'll all be primary weapons. Man, this is so disappointing. At least we got some good burners. Can finally evolve some of my I don't know, I got like four star veteran weapons and other stuff going on that I'll need some burners for. But yeah, out of all those crates, man, 24 crates, we got one four star skinned weapon and it's an AC-30, so I don't know guys, the drop rates are just low and if you really want something good of, of the skinned weapons, you're I think you're going to have to shell out some money. Um, you know, good luck getting anything out of these crates, I'm sure. Couple people will get some good stuff, but I don't know. This is my only trophy to show for it, so whatever. That's just the reality of this game. Um, you know, don't don't get too caught up in, in the whole the next crate might be it. You know, don't spend too much money, but <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I don't even know how to end this right now. Just uh, overall a little disappointed, but 
whatever. I got enough weapons to work on building out, so it's not the end of the world. And like I said, if you're a new player, this is absolutely something you, you want to take advantage of. Even like the four star A500s, like you can build those up and you can jump right into this game and, and be competitive right off the bat. So um, definitely good for newer players. Drop rates, you know, not looking too good, but that'll do it for this video, I guess. And, uh, you know, be sure to subscribe. I do got daily After Pulse videos. Uh, one of my next videos will be showing all of the new gear, the four star set, the five star set, and the six star set. So be sure to subscribe and you'll get notified when I do post that. Might be useful for you. Looks like some really, really awesome gear. Um, might be, you know, I just posted a video that my Patriot AG10 was my best new farming setup and now this new gear might shake things up again for farming because, well, you'll see the boost coming up, but you know, it really might shake things up for farming. We'll, we'll see, but um, that'll be coming up. Just uh, be sure to subscribe to get notified. And as always, I'll catch you on the next video.